Hello boys and girls, we have moved on to now uh, lesson 7-3 where we're going to continue talking about scientific notation, standard notation, and expanded notation um, as well as exponential, ex exponential notation. We're going to actually apply scientific notation by studying some very big numbers. For example, if you look at page 215 of your math journal, you're going to read about the history of Earth. As you read about geologists, anthropologists, paleontologists, uh, all these scholars who have studied the ground and have studied the Earth and the way the animals have lived here and the bones of different animals, they're able to estimate the age of the Earth, the age of bacteria, when fish per first appeared, when dinosaurs disappeared or became extinct. And they express the numbers in a very um, easy way to understand. Instead of writing a number with ten zeros or nine zeros, they'll write a number, for example, when fish first appeared. Fish appeared for uh, to the tenth times ten to the eighth power. Well, how, how long would that be? We count the number of zeros. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And over here, instead of putting the, ten, the one, we're actually just multiplying four times one, which is four. Four hundred, what would that be? Million billion, 10 billion, 400 billion years ago? That's when fish first appeared. And there's a theory that states that we came from fish. The fish eventually walked onto the ground and that's how life on the ground came to be. Uh, that's just a scientific theory. Uh, then we move on to um, number 10. And so the next page on page... 216, you have to fill in the numbers. On the next page, on page 216, you'll find a, a table or a chart. We call this the place value chart. Here you will write everything, all the numbers that you have read on page 215, you will write them as standard notation. So for example, as I gave the example of the fish, if you had, uh, the, the fish first appeared about 4 times 10 to the 8th power years ago. Um, to express this number as a standard notation, go along the top of the chart and find 10 to the 8th power. And then just write a 4 beneath it. But you're going to write it on number 3. On row number 3, because this is for the answer number 3. The same applies to number 1 you'll find Earth was formed 5 times 10 to the 9th power years ago. Well, find nine to, 10 to the 9th power on the top. Okay? And then just fill it in. Write the number in standard notation. You write the number and then fill in all the zeros. And you'll do that from 1 to 10. Just write them. And you'll see that the smallest number is actually 10 at the very bottom. For the last three questions at the bottom, 11, 12, and 13, you are expected to compare these numbers. For example, question 11 says, according to the estimates by scientists, about how many years passed from the formation of Earth until the first signs of life? So compare. How long from number 1 to number 2? 5 times 10 to the 9th power years ago, and 4 times 10 to the 9th power years ago. How many years from that 5 to that 4 are there? And just write it down in standard notation. Standard. Write the actual number. Do that for 12 and 13.